Okay, I'm gonna play a little Subnautica here before I have to go to work. Um, I don't know. I don't, don't think I have anything to say before we get started. Let's just uh, get into it. Um, last time I played this was a couple days ago, and I um. Oh, what had happened? Oh, I had been able to build the, um... I had been able to build the, um... Oh, man. Once again, I forget that this game takes a little while to load. I really gotta remember that I'm probably... My best bet is probably to load the game. Um... During my intro time, and then just, then like, pause it. Um, rather than to wait for this um what was i saying though oh i had managed to build the um high capacity oxygen tank uh so that's pretty cool um and i i also have the sea glide now that's so weird how that starts open and then like <laughs> i've noticed that a few times um and so i might i think my main objective is like, probably like finding lead, I think, for the, um, uh, so that I can make the radiation suit, because I can make fiber mesh from the, um, the, whatever they're called, like, creep vines, I think they're called, um, I think that's right, where's the fiber mesh? Fiber mesh, yeah, from creep vine samples. Um, so that's easy enough to get. I don't, I've never seen lead before. So, so that's something that I don't, <clears throat> that I don't know how to get. <clears throat> I've got a ton of first aid kits. I keep feeling like, I keep feeling like I, I need to grab them whenever they're available. Um, but I think I'm going to go ahead and store a few. I definitely, I probably should scrounge up some water and food. Maybe try to see if I can find some more salt to make cured food. Um, before I go too far away, I guess. And, and that's, does that lost, is this lo losing charge because of this light that's on it? Can I turn that light off? Is that a is that a keyboard command I have? 
Maybe I need to holster, quote unquote, holster my my C glide. Tool alternate use F. Um. I need to holster that to keep from losing power on it. I'm still not sure how to like charge things. I don't know if I need to make more batteries. Because I have stuff like that and the the repair tool and the scanner. Like they're all down on power and I don't know. Um I don't know. I don't know how to put more power in them. Like, it seems like that's would be a key thing to do, and I don't. And I don't know how to do it. But, um, oops. Whatever. Let's, let's get in the water. Let's get in the water and find us some something. It's been a few days since I played this, so I might have to, like, re-remember some controls. Um, yeah, let's find some bladder fish, and some peepers, and hopefully some salt. Peepers are all over the place. I'm going to see if I can find salt first, before I worry about peepers. <coughs> bladder fish I will snag if I can see them. Because they don't take any extra work. Oh, there's quartz. Do I need more glass for stuff? Not sure if I do or not. Oh, copper's good, though. You can always use more copper. Oh. They're bladder fish. I investigated this little... These, all these containers. I'm sure I have. Anywho, we're here for a specific reason, and it's not to look at this stuff, probably. It's to find salt. There's some. I would love to find a bunch of salt if I could. Man. I think those guys are pretty good for food. Um, oh my god, yeah, the radiation is a lot closer out than it used to be. Like, I used to be able to get pretty deep into those vines before that was an issue. Um, Cool, titanium. Just what I don't need. Um, yeah, there's so much titanium. I wish... I wish there was an, a, an, a place... Is that a thing I've already... Yeah, it was a sea glide fragment that I scanned in the past. Or at least that I don't need to scan now. It's probably a more accurate way of putting it. Let's see what's down in here. those assholes. You want some? Oh, fuck, radiation? Am I drifting close to that thing? Yeah, I guess I am, aren't I? 
What? Come. Is that something? Titanium. Not super useful. Oh, there's some salt though. Excellent. Excellent. I wish I could find a really good source of salt though. Like, it just hasn't happened so far. Oh, mobile vehicle bay fragment. No oh, shit. Fuck off. That hurt a lot. Um, those guys are not fucking around. Where's my first aid? Oh, god damn it! Oh, I do that all the time! I wonder if I can remap drop. I keep dropping shit I don't want to drop. Oh, okay. At least that time I was able to re-grab it. Have I lost that thing? Where was that? I really want to try to go get a scan of that. And I'm willing to risk trying to fight these fuckers off. Where are you? Fuck off. There it is, I think. Okay. Excellent. Now. How am I doing? Found three salt. That's... <gasps> Jesus! Fuck off! Let's, I guess let's go back at this point, and I'll try to grab, I'll see if I can grab peepers and bladder fish on the way, and maybe see if I can find some salt as so, well. It's probably going to be hard to find salt in the dark, though. Really digging this high capacity oxygen tank, though. Much less of a concern about about running out of running out of air, or whatever. Nope, bladder fish. I need you. And I saw some quartz a second ago. I think. I? Where the fuck was that quartz? Oh, I am running low on oxygen now, though. Gotta get snag some more peepers. Come here, boy. I don't know if they're boys. I know they're delicious. That's what I know about peepers. Delicious and nutritious. Come on. They're a little bit of a pain to catch, though. What was that? No, come here. Oh, 
Okay. Alright. Let's get on up in here. Let's see if there's any new messages on the radio. There aren't. Let's get another first aid kit. Use it. Um, and let's make some food and water. Oh, first. First, let me get trinked up. Because I have. I have water on me already. And let's see. Um, sustenance, water. But yeah, I would love to I would love to find a better source of salt so that I could start making more um whatever it's called, disinfected water. But for now it definitely seems to be way easier to um it seems to be way easier to catch the bladder fish. Um, uh, then to find salt. Alright, now with what salt we found, let's cure a few peepers. Oh, perfect. Oh, wait, no, that's probably just because I'm out of salt. Um, yeah, I've still got, like, three more peepers. Oh, no, I've got one. One more peeper. Um, which I guess I'll hold on to? Um, let's see. I also guess I'll make some... Do I need copper wire right now? I don't know. As far as I know, so far though, the only use for quartz is glass. So I will go, go ahead and make glass out of my quartz. Um, I keep wondering if I should make a floating air pump and pipes. But I don't I don't know. Like, I haven't found any deep stuff where I've been so far where I've been like, oh, I I clearly need to, like, get down in this or whatever, right? You know? Like, um... Yeah, I don't know. Alright, okay. So I probably should... I should stash a few things. Um... Like this cover and that, and the why is it not switching containers? And that glass, and I don't know why I'm holding on to silicone. Um, I guess put this, put this titanium in here. I'm not sure. Oh, jeez, I'm not sure about this uh, sample analyzer I found before either. Like it says it's non-functional, but like, why? Like I mean, like what do I? What do I do? Why is it non-functional? Can I do something with it? Is it because I need to, like, build a lab or something first? I don't know. Um, I guess, like, let me put it in a slot and, like, see what ha happens if I... Yeah, it pro I probably need to be in, like, an actual habitat or whatever. That's probably the deal with that, I'm guessing. Um, okay. So, I'm not... I'm not 100% sure. Oh, hey! This must be a lot of the shit that I've just dropped. That I was like, oh, there's I don't need to have this in my storage anymore. This is taking up space. And I just fucking like came out of came out of the pod and immediately dropped it. 
just drifted down there, I guess. Um, oh, shit. I should put the flare back on that, I guess. Um, yeah, I don't know. Um, I've got this new oxygen tank. It should let me go deeper. Much easier. So, like... I guess I should see what the what deep places there might be. Though, fucking hate those things. God, those things are the worst. Not even any sulfur in there. What an asshole. Sandstone? <gasps> Fuck yes, lead. Oh, please be another one of those in here. I can't scan that. Copper! Lead, yes. I think I only need two. That is excellent, excellent news. I mean, I would be stoked to find more. Although, at this point, I'm concerned about making sure I can get out of here. Okay. Let me go for air. Let's go back down in there. There are definitely more deposits of various kinds in here. I guess this is like where you might want to have a, a chain of pipes, huh? Things are the fucking worst. Titanium! <sighs> I mean, I got the lead that I, I'm pretty sure I need. So. I can't complain too much. I guess. I mean, I'm gonna complain. Should I complain? Maybe not. In fact, I'll say probably not. But I'm gonna. That looks like more stuff that I dropped that maybe I shouldn't have or didn't mean to. Like, why would I have dropped quartz? Or just straight up titanium? Or copper. Like salvage, like I'm not, I'm not, I'm no longer going out of my way for uh, metal salvage because, like, it's like, it's like literally, like I have those floating lockers and like literally all that's in them is titanium. Um, like I'm like, oh, I have too much titanium again. Let me build another locker out of titanium to put my excess titanium in. <sighs> so yeah, like, so these are all just full of titanium. Um, I mean, not full. Not, like, literally full. Um, but it's all that's in any of them. Okay, so. Let's get in here. Let's Dash some stuff, like especially this lead. <laughs> I guess. Um.
What do I do with this sulfur? I don't know. Um. It's fine, right? It's totally fine. Um, I guess now I should go find creep vine samples. Let's do that. Alright, nearest creep vines are in the general direction of the aurora. Um, I believe. Shouldn't be too hard to find. Ooh, looks like there might be some interesting stuff down there. Uh, yep, there we go. Whole fucking forest of them off over this way. If I can find more salt as well, even fucking better. Let's see if there's anything in this. Oh. Fuck off! Is that the same mobile vehicle bay fragment? I don't think so. I thought that one was much deeper. What the hell? Why can't I select my scanner? Okay, yeah, that was a new... Uh, mobile vehicle bay fragment. Okay, that's cool. It's very cool. Alright, let's just... Things are the worst. All right. Oh, those are big. Okay. I didn't really, I forgot those took up so much space. I guess I can't get any more. I need to. I need to make space for him, I guess. I might need to make a, a non-titanium <laughs> locker. I'll have to distinguish it somehow from the other lockers, though. I know you can put, like, names on them or something, or, like, signs on them. You need to be able to put, like... You need to be able to put, like, um... You need to be able to, like, change their colors or something. That would be cool. Um. Okay, so we have some mesh. We have room for a couple more samples. Jeez, these decompose so fast. I probably can't even use this one now. Um. That's ridiculous. Um. All right. Let me give me a couple titanium and I guess give me a couple titanium out here and let me make a container. And where should we put this one? Um, let's put it pretty close. Um, uh, let me see. It's just like right here. And God, 
What is that stalker doing this fucking close? Non titanium. Non tit. No titanium. Whatever. Good enough. Not enough letters. Put some put some sulfur in there, put some glass in there, put some copper, some quartz. Some cured peepers, I guess. I'll just drink a bottle of water at this point. Ah, that's pretty good. That should be fine. Get up inside. Let's... Let me... Let me grab some other basic crap out of here that... I probably don't need to keep a bunch of inside the thing. I can't. There's no way I can put all of that in there, but that's okay. All right, non-titanium locker. Where where are you? There you are. Um, stick this in there, and then like some sulfur, and like yeah. Let's not put the peepers in here. Let's not put anything in here that I'd be like, oh, I gotta have it now. Um. That seems pretty good. Let's drop that garbo. Let's drop this creature egg too. Like I don't I don't need a giant fucking creature egg. How is that a thing I might need? That's just taking up space. In fact, same goes for these. Give me those. I'm just gonna drop those. Put this silicone and sulfur back in here and that fiber mesh. And I'm going to cook that fever and eat it. So an interesting thing I've learned is that as dumb as it seems, because this does not seem realistic at all, um, food seems to keep a whole lot longer, or like things that could be food, keep a whole lot longer if you don't cook them. Like I, I think I have yet to see just a peeper that I've caught go bad. But... Um, Fucking, fucking cooked fever. That shit goes bad real fast. Uh. So any hoozle. Am I heading in the right direction? Yeah, roughly. Right. Yeah, here we go. See, I wonder... God! Fuck off! No one likes you, stalker. Probably pretty much filled. It might be able to squeeze one in, but... Like, they're already old. Like, I literally just cut those. <laughs> it's so insane. It's so insane how fast those go bad. Um, I don't know, like... I don't know if they need to be a certain level of freshness uh, to turn them into the mesh. Um, but it just seems crazy how fast stuff decomposes. Okay, whatever. That got me two more. I think... Um, I think all I need is like two and two? Maybe? 
for, um, yeah, I need two and two. So I have two, and I just need the two lead. I think I found three lead? No, I only found two lead. Well, so far this is the only thing I know of that I need it for, so. All right. Let's get a radiation suit. Heck yeah, and I think it automatically equipped it. Awesome. So now I should be able to get closer to the, um, closer to the, uh, the Aurora. Um, nice. All right, so I have my water in storage or no? No. Okay, I should do something about that, probably. Um, yeah, let's catch some bladder fish. And, and make some more bottled water before we go on too much of a journey. Because I only have a couple bottles left. Um, but yeah, I haven't decided, like, that I want to, because, like, if I could change, if I could change this option in the game, I can't, I don't believe. Um, if I could change this option in the game while playing, I would, like, I would consider changing the game to be on the mode where you don't have to worry about food and water. Because it does kind of seem like busy work to me. Um, but I don't... At the moment, I don't feel like it's enough of an annoyance that I'm like, oh, I, I'd rather start the game over, you know? I think it's fine. Um, but yeah, I do kind of feel like... Uh, like if that wasn't a part of it, I think the I think the game would be totally fine without that being part of it. And it's an option, right? Like it's an option to play that way. Um, so, so, yeah, right? Like, like you know, Minecraft. You know, arguably like the, you know, kind of the. You know, not the oh, fuck. Certainly not the first of these kinds of games at all, by any stretch of the imagination, but, like, the one that really kicked off this whole, like, exploration, crafting, um, kind of, kind of genre that's become so huge, um, doesn't have food and water as a concern. Ah, Jesus. Fucking bladderfish. Um, you know, and it's still a compelling game that you know, people love. Uh, so yeah, so I don't, I don't feel like, I don't feel like the, you know, the hunger and fr thirst management is like a necessity or whatever. Um, okay, I'm surprised it hasn't like given me the radiation detected thing. I figured it would still do that, but it would just let me know that it's cool. That, like it's fine. I wonder if there's still like a, like a, like a like a limit of, as to like how close I can get though. Or if I'm really just going to be able to cruise right up to the fucking wreckage. I mean, apparently that There's a lot of, lot of stuff here. Yeah, let's learn how to make a desk. That's super fucking important to me right now. Oh, yeah. Gotta know how to make a desk. Don't I already know how to make a sea glide? Oh. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know that that was... That that's what that would do now. Yeah, it's like I 100% know it. Oh, an office chair. Also very important. Again, 
super important that we're able to, like, deck out a fucking office with desks and stuff. That's really not... I don't know if that's worth the battery on my scanner, honestly. I have so much titanium, I don't know what to do with it right now. Um... So maybe I won't keep scanning those when I find them. Because really, why? A grav trap. It's interesting. Wonder what that will be. Ooh, damaged wiring. Use repair tool. Interesting. Okay. Let's put that over there. Oh. Oh. Very interesting. Is that, is that what I'm in here for? Just to scan more stuff or Ah, oh, supply crate. Oh, first aid kit, that's all. I was hoping that would have something more interesting in it. Anything else? Oh, another supply crate. Another first aid kit. Another beacon fragment. I assume I'll just give me titanium. Um, okay, is there anything else in here? Not really f finding anything else. So, shoot, where was the door? How did I get out again? drink some water. Alright. What else is around here? Anything? Is it time to move on from this particular spot? Might be time to move on. Yeah, I think it's time to move on. Oh, I'm getting a radio call. Should I rush back? Hell no. That's not how I do shit. Oh, what the fuck are you? Are you a thing I've seen before? I think you're a thing I've seen before. Love what I'm seeing of those these things, that's for sure. Oh. Okay. I mean I'm looking at that and I'm thinking, why do I need that much titanium? But I'm sure I will in the future. But like, it's fucking titanium everywhere. Alright, so here's our big old crashed ship. Clearly not intended for you to really get up this fucking close on it. The textures are not that good, to be honest. Um, I wonder if we're able to, like, get inside it from under underwater or something somewhere. Fuck off. Oh. 
gotta learn about a propulsion cannon. That's obviously critical. Critical information. Metal salvage. Metal salvage. So much metal salvage. Jesus! Fuck off! Definitely need to like learn how to make more weapons. Like there was some there was something about like like oh like in the f fucking republic or empire or whatever the f fuck. You are an asshole. Get it out of my face. Like, weapons are outlawed or whatever. But, like, clearly, clearly we are going to learn to make some other weapons, right? Alright, we've learned a lot. We've had a lot of fun today. Um, but it's obviously time to go home. I'm gonna use my sea glide because it's a long way away. Even I've been trying to spare, spare, uh, spare the battery. Um, uh, hey there. Hey there, Revo Flame. I've actually been playing Subnautica a few times, um, but I, I didn't. I haven't seen you around the last couple times I played. Um, yeah, the the Aurora went went boom. The Aurora did did go boom. Um, I don't I don't know what the Reaper is. So I, so I probably haven't seen it. Um, Aurora, we're approaching the planet now. We have a landing site for you that's, well, it's better than the alternatives. We've sent you the coordinates. It'll take us a couple of days to align our orbit. Okay. We'll be able to establish Interesting. direct contact with you during that time. And we're coming in to get you. Cross your fingers, the weather holds. Don't leave us waiting. Sunbeam out. Okay. Uh. Anywho, what was I? What was I gonna do here? Um. Besides, just see what's what um so you can get inside the aurora huh cool okay so i'll have to go back and check that out um one thing i've been wondering that maybe you can you can help me with is how do you how do you um how do you charge up the power on things that have power. Do you need to like make batteries and use them on them or 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 what? I haven't wanted to waste resources making making batteries um if that's not how that works. Um but I've been curious about that. Uh is there a new Oh, I can make a beacon. <laughs> Maintains and broadcasts its physician. Okay. Cool, I guess. That could be useful. Uh, I could make a propulsion cannon. 
Ugh, but I need to be able to make a wiring kit, which I'm pretty sure I recall needs gold. I think. Hmm, okay. Batteries and reload. That makes sense. Um, are, are power cells, like, the same as batteries, but better? I wondered about that as well, because I haven't seen anything that, like, requires a uh, power cell to build yet. Oh, no, wiring kits need silver. Okay, I've only found silver, like, once, so... Um, well, I should probably make some a few batteries then. I think batteries aren't too hard to make, right? What are they? Two acid mushrooms and copper. Yeah, I have a fair amount of copper. Power cells are for submarines. Oh, okay. Um. Yeah, I've got some copper. Let's make some batteries. And I won't have to worry quite so much about running out of space for things. Um, uh, okay, so I need to go grab some acid mushrooms. This is my garbage file right here. That's where I've been dropping stuff that I realized I didn't have room for. And that there was no reason for me to hang on to. Okay. And roughly how much will a battery... Uh... Yeah, those creep vine areas are a pain because those stalkers are a pain. <laughs> um, um, but yeah, I, I think that is where I found the silver before. Um, how much? How much will a battery? How much will a battery recharge something? Does it like depend on the item, or is it a specific amount of of charge? Did I have any? No, okay. I need two more. <laughs> okay. Let's see here. I don't need all that titanium. I'll save that salt for now as well. Um, save a couple first aid kits. Uh, I could probably use a couple more bottles of water before I venture too far. titanium locker. Oh, that one's full. Oh, that one's also full. I just have so much titanium. Um, alright. Let's find some bladder fish. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Alright, let me see if I can grab one more. There we go.
Yes, but what you don't understand about me, Rebel Flame, is I'm um, I'm very overcautious. So I always want to have lots of food and water and medical supplies. So yeah, I'm sh I'm sure I'm carrying too much of like everything, but. But I'm always I'm always paranoid about not having enough stuff. Yeah, no, I hmm yeah, the problem is I, I know I know that the bleach the bleach is better for water, but I feel like it's it's a bigger pain in the butt for me to find salt than it is to catch those fish right now. And um and the salt I've been using, I've wanted to use for cured food because the cooked food goes bad so goddamn fast. Oh, fuck off. Anyhow, I'm gonna go try to see if I can uh, get inside. Get inside the Aurora. So you said it's from the front. That would be this way, I guess. Um, and, uh, yeah, how, how much, how much will a battery recharge a thing? Like, all the way? Or am I gonna need to use, am I gonna need to use a couple batteries to, to recharge, like, my Sea Glide, or... Ugh, those things are pain too. Oh, speaking of salt, though, there's some. Oh, God. So many very angry fish. All right, no problem. Thanks for your thanks for your help. Oops. Oh, I see. Um. Actually, just wanted to put that away at the moment, though. Life form readings in this region are sparse. The Aurora's radioactive fallout will have devastating effects on the alien ecosystem if not contained within the next 24 hours. Like, I care about the alien ecosystem. Wait, this is probably not where I'm supposed to get in. Oh god, okay. For a second I thought I was stuck. Um... I guess I kind of care about the alien ecosystem. It'll be hard to feed myself if everything is dead. Why is there a sparkly thing right there? Oh. Oh, probably electricity. 
It's probably not good to touch. Oh god, what the fuck is that? The fuck are you th things? Not a fan of those. Hmm. I know these don't look like places I would I would want to go. Um learn more office supply blueprints. Oh, fuck off. God, there's so many of these fucking things. All right. All right. Where should I go now? I haven't really found anything super useful here. Disappointingly at the moment. Wow, okay, that thing's huge. Good lord. All right, there's the Reaper. Now I have now I have met the Reaper and died. That was a good time. Good times. Good times were had by all. Um, what did I what did I lose? I wasn't really carrying that much. That was it was too critical. Um, all right, well, forget that. Let's go, let's go to the Sunbeam landing site. That's a bit of a drive. And also, oh, wait, what? Oh, I see. I, I can take the battery out. Okay. Alrighty, well I will 
In that case, um, I'll, uh, I'll see if I can find some silver, maybe. Uh, since you said I should be able to find some silver in this general region, I'll see if I can hunt some down. Oh, lead. That's good. I haven't been able to find much lead so far. Finding too much around here yet. I haven't even been able to find any salt yet. Just displaying. Ah, oh, Jesus! <laughs> Fucking, I hate those things. Oh, there's some salt, I think. Yep, that's good. Oh, wait, did I? Ah, more salt. Excellent. There's something. Ah, uh, titanium. Just what I super needed. Get the fuck out of here. Get out. Go away. What the fuck is happening? What the fuck was that? The fish like hypnotizing me or something? That was some weird shit I did not expect. Get out of here! No one likes you! Well, so far my search for silver has not been successful, but I have found some salt and some weird, creepy-ass fish. glide fragment. Don't really care about that.
copper is good. Fucking. Real sick of these, uh. Real sick of these stalkers, though. Oh, I think I need to scan more of those yet. Ah, excellent. Okay. Oh, what is that? Scanner room fragment. Okay. Salt. That's good. Found any flipping silver though? Oh, whatever. Just keep cruising around for now. Oh, what are these? These look interesting. Interesting and possibly like things I shouldn't fuck with just at the moment. Oh, there's another one of those guys. Oh, a few of those guys. Boy. Fucking having a party over here. What's up, big dudes? Any of this stuff I haven't scanned before? Oh, there's a barnacle. Copper in a barnacle. Not sure if that makes sense. Oh, shit. It's fucking tiger plants or whatever they're called. Silver ore out of that barnacle. Did not expect that this would be where I'd find some silver ore finally, but. But I will take it. Fuck! Don't like those things. I mean, obviously, I'm not supposed to like them, but. Alright, what was inside that one? Related papyrus. Mm. 
Okay, I probably should get out, get out of the way of that fucking thing. The dunes. The dunes are bad, huh? That's okay, that's interesting. Where's Oh there it is. Grassy plateaus is apparently where I am right now. Detecting increased foreign bacteria levels in the water. Performing a self scan is advised. Okay, voice. Self scan complete. Foreign bacteria count has reached statistically significant levels. No adverse effects detected. Be vigilant for symptoms. Cool. So, first I had to be worried about radiation, and now I've got to be worried about uh, foreign bacteria. Cool. Can't see how that's possibly a problem. I don't know what these are, so I probably shouldn't get close, but I'm going to. How can I not scan this thing? Oh, there we go. Yeah! Fuck off! Suspended here suggest they once floated on the surface. Cool, I guess. Is that important? Is it important to know that these land masses once floated on the surface? No. Hey, more salt. Hooray. Hooray for salt. And a mobile... Okay, I'm, I've already... I've already scanned those up. So I'm probably just going to get titanium? Yeah. I keep hoping maybe I'll get... Um, something other than titanium when I scan some of those, but... It'll probably always just be titanium, I suppose, won't it? Now, why am I getting a radio message? Is it going to be from these guys? They're probably just telling me they're on their way, right? I'm sure everything is fine. Detecting massive energy signature in the region. Cannot identify it. I'm sure there can't be anything possibly going wrong. I'm sure everything is absolutely fine, and they're going to be here in eight and a half minutes, just like they said. on like fucking land and shit. Uh, more of these fucking assholes though. Get the get out of here. God. Go away. Hit fat trees for good food. Okay. Um, oh, they take up a lot of room, though. 
That's why it said my inventory was full. Well, I am low on food. I will eat that peeper. And drink some more. Um, nope, I'll drop it instead, because I am I do that all the time. I don't know why. For some reason, I want to hit... Um, for, for some reason, I want to hit uh, right-click to use stuff. I don't know why. There we go. Two, two big tree chunks. Hopefully they'll still be good. Um, later. When I actually get back to my base. My pod, I should say, I suppose. Well, that's a thing that I didn't expect to see here. These little assholes are so aggressive. Just fuck off. Also, this thing. What is you? I can't scan you. Purple tablet fragments. Yeah, I mean, that's what it is. It's definitely a purple tablet and fragments of it. Oh. Oh, you meant they were good to eat now? I mean, they're not that good to eat now. I thought you meant I needed to take them back and cook with them. Um. Force field control terminal. Sure. Okay. Really, I'll find a I'll find like a whole tablet because I found a I found parts of one already. Um. I assumed I would have to, like, make my own somehow. But, I mean, yeah, I have some time on this timer left, so... I might as well look around. Oh, hey. Okay, thanks. That's a... That's a thing I found here. Yeah, I was I was thinking that myself. And I'm sure I'm sure I'm going to get rescued and that's going to be the end of the game, right? Everything's going to go fine. Um the people from that ship are going to show up right on time. And it this is going to be a very short game. room does that tablet take up? Oh, not really any. Okay. Do 
Do do do do do. Let's, let's go back to where I'm supposed to. Can I climb up this? This price too steep. Oh no! Well, I'm surprisingly good at climbing in my in my suit with fins. <laughs> yeah, okay, I'm, I am glad I didn't come here as soon as I was thinking of coming here. I still don't totally have a sense of uh, how long it takes to get, get places in this game. Um, I'm sure I could have explored underwater for a while, but... Uh, But yeah, I wouldn't have wanted to kill like 10 minutes here. By taking a nice leisurely swim over here was, uh, was good. Well, I hear things. I hear. Oh, okay. All right. Is this some kind of anti, like anti-air defense weapon? Is this why we crashed? Did this thing shoot down the Aurora? Survivor, we see you. Man, I don't know how you held out down there. We broke an atmosphere and we're descending towards the landing site. D don't. Is that a building down there? What do you mean you're carrying? Yeah, I would. Hold on. No turning back. I wouldn't. No. No, guys. No, it's probably not. I wouldn't. I wouldn't do it, guys. Seems like a bad plan. Okay. Well. Interesting. Very interesting. Hmm. Well, that's a bummer. Um, okay. okay, then. Gosh, I was hoping they'd at least, like, crash around here and I'd, I'd get something. Get something out of it. But, no, they just got totally fucked up. And here we are. Cool. Super cool. Super, super cool. Hmm. Well. <laughs> Why do I not have emotions? Um, I, I guess because I expected... I pretty much expected something like this to happen. Um... Yeah, like, this is terribly surprising. 
I, I mean, I figured something was going to go wrong with, with their rescue anyway. <laughs> Yeah, I'm probably never going to be a very big, a very big... Oh, what's going on? Of a metal alloy with unprecedented integrity. Integrity. No in database performing structural analysis. Yeah, I'm probably never going to be, a, like, a, a a big streamer because I don't... I don't think I have the kind of reactions that people like to see from, from people streaming stuff. Which is one reason I haven't bothered to, to like, set up my webcam for for a uh, for face cam stuff um hmm well this place seems really cool can i just come live here no nah, this place looks like not a fun place to live very uncomfortable. Ooh, I got an achievement. How exciting. <laughs> Unknown language. Unknown language. Attempting translation. Alien data terminal. <laughs> uh, where did they say they put that? Oh, here we go. Alien data. Discovered inside an alien facility, it was not possible to translate any useful information. However, scans have returned some information on the device itself. It's likely a solid state computer, although there's no clear way to interface with it. On approach, it began producing a low frequency radio wave containing complex but recognizable data patterns. It's likely the alien species which designed this technology evolved or genetically selected sensory apparatus to hear and understand the information being broadcast by the device, and to communicate back. The mental processing power required to perform this kind of telepathy would imply the designers were considerably more psychologically developed than the common human. Further research required. Okay. Interesting. Your best probability of interfacing with this facility is achieved by accessing the control room in the lower section. Ah, oh, man. This place is just so f super inviting. They really know how to make a place homey. Um, nope, that is what I wanted. Oh, okay, that looked huge. I was like, that's got to take up a ton of space in my inventory. I'm glad it doesn't. Um, interesting. Can I... Analysis of the patterns on the walls cannot ascertain whether their purpose is aesthetic or functional. Further data required. Okay... Great. Great. Oh, there's another one. Why don't I scan one of these two before I take it? Ion cube. Screen mineral substance has no entry on the periodic table and an unprecedented ability to store huge amounts of ionic energy within it. Likely grown artificially, cubic appearance suggests it's been cut from a larger deposit. Each cube contains the equivalent ionic energy of 5 kilotons of TNT. Under the right conditions, the energy could be released in a controlled manner. Likely used as batteries, but would require a substantial power source to be recharged. Interesting. Okay. A 
unknown language, attempting translation. Enforcement platform schematic. This data set appears to be a multi-dimensional schematic of some kind. By mapping the pattern to three-dimensional space, it is possible to gather a basic understanding of this facility's internal workings. Construction material. The facility's unknown construction material is identified as an ultra-hard non-reactive metal amalgam synthesized from off-world materials. There is no indication that it can be damaged or destroyed by available means. Power. The schematic indicates the facility was to be powered by a separate self-sustaining power plant located elsewhere on the planet. The location is not listed, but there is evidence the designers intended to harness the planet's natural thermal energy. Layout. The facility consists of the upper engineering section, where the schematic was found, and the control room, which is accessed via a security-sealed elevator shaft or a separate underwater moon pool. Control. The control room in the lower section houses the only known way to interface with the facility. However, the schematic does not detail the operation procedure or installed security measures. Okay, so I am... Okay, so I am in the upper section. So the control room... Okay, so I have no idea how to get to the control room. Okay. Ugh, I think a little... Getting a little bit of frame rate issues. I might need to turn down my graphic settings a bit at some point. Oh. Oh, okay. I did not mean to actually step off that edge. Um. Uh, okay, that's cool. Was I done up there? I don't know. Maybe. Whatever. I'll just keep looking around. Oh boy. Okay. This place is so large and mostly empty. That's what seems so weird to me about this about this place. Alien rifle. Must have been built designed with a humanoid user in mind. Hmm, okay. No obvious way to remove it. Well, I was commenting earlier that I definitely could use some could use some better weapons in this game. It's this knife, this knife I have doesn't seem to be able to kill anything. You'd think it should be able to kill those little bugs at least, but no. Maybe I killed one of the rabbit rays with a knife? I can't remember if I even was able to do that. Alien arch. Ceremonial or religious, industrial applications, advanced transportation network. Sure. Who knows? Could be, could be all of those things. All of them at once. Can I climb the arch? <laughs> no, I don't think so. Alright. Let's go up those ramps, I guess. Oh. Oh, was that where I got that? Yeah, that was where I got that cube. It, oh, there's so little... There's so little in the way of, like, navigational landmarks in this place. I... I... I feel very much like I don't know if I've seen everything or not. Oh, can't scan the tablet. 
Okay. I wonder what this thing is. A doomsday device. Wonderful. It contains enough potential energy to destroy the entire planet along with most of the solar system. Fortunately, it has malfunctioned. Cool. That's super cool. Thanks for making one of those, aliens. Every weird precursor alien facility needs a scans indicate the facility's control room lies beyond this door. Needs a doomsday device. Why wouldn't you want a, a device small enough to be carried in the hand that can wipe out the entire solar system? Nothing could possibly go wrong. Is there anything down here, or is this just like... Yeah, I definitely need to tweak my graphics settings a bit, I think. Definitely having some freeminess when I run around too fast. Hello. Oh god, what are you doing to me? The control panel is broadcasting a message. Translation reads, warning, infected individuals may not disable the weapon. This planet is under quarantine. Okay. Okay, thing. Translating background broadcast. Downloading summary to databank. Um... Okay, so this device contains a lot of energy, and it can shoot it at stuff. Yeah, that's, that's not great. It's not great, I would say. Um... Apparently I'm infected. Self-scan complete. Bacterial infection in your system is progressing. Detecting skin irritation and immune system response. Further data required to identify bacterial strain. Hmm, okay, well... Am I done here, then? <laughs> so, I'm infected with something. Which means I can't turn off this gun can't turn off the giant space gun, and unless I turn off the giant space gun, there's like no conceivable way of getting rescued. Um, so I guess... Uh, I guess I'm screwed. No, I guess I need to find a way to get to uninfect myself. 
I mean, I guess I would probably need to do that anyway, because who knows what the hell this bacteria is going to do to me. Um... So did I see everything there was to see around here? So I guess that pedestal is nothing. I feel like I'm probably done in here now. That, that's safe to say. Where was the... Oh, no, not in here. What's with these lights that light up? I don't know. Um, where was the pool of water? I obviously gotta... Gotta take a dip. Here we go. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Oh my. There's a bunch of interesting stuff here, it looks like. But I probably should get to the surface. Hopefully not get killed by anything. Hopefully. That's the hope. Okay, that was fun. That was fun and interesting, and I hate these bugs. Fuck off. Um. Seek fluid intake. should save, huh? Yeah, that's a good idea. I normally save kind of obsessively. But, um... I've been, uh, forgetting it. Uh, I guess. Vital signs stabilizing. Mmm, delicious tree. That is pretty useful. Okay. Okay, yeah. Uh thanks for thanks for stopping in and for the for the tips. I'm I'm probably gonna quit pretty soon anyway. This seems like a a pretty good place uh, to stop for the day, having found some exciting alien stuff. Um, so I'm thinking of trying to... I'm thinking of trying to um, make my way back to the pod and then, and then probably quitting.
shale chunks. Ah, gold. Excellent. Yeah. Fuck off! Ugh, okay. Well, I don't want to get too... Too, too out... Out in the way from... <sighs> from where I need to go, so... Let's, uh... Let me uh, get out my sea glide, and I'm gonna head home. I'll have to come back here later. Hopefully, I'll be able to find my way back. I'm sure I will. If I had known what what interesting things I might find, I would have like I would have brought I would have made a beacon and brought it. But of course, I was like, I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to need a beacon for. I haven't found any stuff that... That I'm going to need to remember how to get back to. Wow, yeah, I didn't, um, I didn't really expect to find, uh, like, crazy ancient alien stuff in this game. That's interesting. Um, I'm into it, I think. I'm not, I'm not not into it. Alright, so I'm almost back to the life pod. I think I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna do, um... I'm gonna do a few things here. First off, play this radio message, of course. Playing partially translated broadcast. Nine new biological subjects designated. Okay. That was weird. I guess that was what was... No? What? Does that mean that's what was broadcast while I was on initially on my way to the... Frickin... To the meeting point? And, and I saw the radio thing pop up? That seems... Weird, if that's the case. Oh, oh cool, you can see the old beacons there were. Okay, that's cool. I was worried, because I went, when I went to Life Pod 17, I was worried I wouldn't be able to find it again at one point. I didn't know you could, there was a way to go in and turn them back on. Wait, I can make purple tablets? Oh, okay. Interesting. Um, mobile vehicle bay, which I think I'll need to make the Seamoth. Um, let's see. Um, Floodlights. I don't think. Is there anything else I've really learned that's super important? Not. 
really. I'm gonna be able to make a real nice desk. Eventually. Um. What do I need for that? What do I need for a wiring kit again? That's some useful things I'll be able to build once I can make some wiring kits. Silver. That's right, silver. Gold is what I need for computer chips. I actually could make a computer chip, like, right now, apparently. I don't know what I would do with it at this point. Um... Okay. Alright, alright. Any new and interesting things I need to check out in here? I don't think so. Propulsion cannon. Um, looks like I'll be able to move, move stuff around with it. Um, so that could be useful. Um, once I can build it. And of course we have stuff we'll be able to put in a habitat once we get a habitat build. Oh, submarine. Okay. Um. Okay. Um, how do we build... How do we build one of these? I assume we also need a mobile vehicle bay or whatever. Uh, what else did we find out about? Shale outcroppings can have gold, lithium, and diamond. Oh, okay. So I guess maybe finding gold was actually the unlucky thing to find there. Um, let's see, what do we know about ancient floaters? Um, Assessment incredible. Vast floaters have mat matured in an ingenious symbiosis with the land they've attached to. The attached land mass is raised in the water, increasing sunlight and creating plant growth. Huh. Huh. Okay, so they literally will float. Float stuff in the water up to the surface. Hmm, interesting. Okay. Void or incapacitate? Well, I wish... I wish I could. I wish I knew how to uh, incapacitate them. Um... May aid in flotation of sunken objects. Okay. Mm, what else? Bulbo trees. Edible high water content. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some, some plants. Okay. Alright. Well. That was all pretty cool. Pretty interesting. Um, I can make some... Or, no, I know how to make purple tablets. Mobile vehicle bay. 
I think I could even make a mobile vehicle bay. I think I, I definitely have enough titanium. I think I could make a power cell lubricant. I just don't, I don't think it's actually useful for me right now. Um, all right, well, I don't think I have an interest in sorting out my inventory and shit just now. So I think I'm going to stop right here. Um, I'll put some stuff away right away. Um, uh, and I'll probably start my next session with, like, finding food and water and stuff. <laughs> um, yep, yeah, and I'll call it quits for now. Um, so, uh, thanks for watching. Um, thanks to anyone who watches in the future, and, um, I'll be back. Uh, another day. Tomorrow I'm probably going to play um, Zero Time Dilemma before work. Um, so I'm not, not totally sure the next time I'll stream this, but it'll be available afterwards anyway, or um, either, either on my Twitch channel or I'll upload it to YouTube. Well, I mean both, but my stuff on, on Twitch expires pretty quickly since I'm not yet even an affiliate, and who knows, maybe never will be. Who cares? Um, I'm not, not really concerned. Um, anyway, uh, yeah, thanks, thanks for watching, and I'll, uh, see you next time. Bye.